Okay, so we're going to learn today how to uh, give credit to participants who have signed up, uh, cancel sessions, uh, give no-shows, or even add someone to your study who uh, did not sign up using Sona, but you want to add them manually. So you've logged into Abington, uh, Sona, and you click on whatever study you are interested in looking at. We'll click on this one. This is a test study. Um, this is the information about the study. If we click on View Administer Time Slots, this is the same place that you go to add time slots. If we click on this, we will see that we have the following slots available, and we'll see this white spot here that says John Doe awaiting action. So on Tuesday the 12th at 230 to 3 in 236 with researcher Michael Bernstein, there is one individual named John Doe who is awaiting action. One person signed up. So this is valuable to you as a researcher. It means that if, you, if, if this is July 12th and it's at 12.30, uh, you don't have to come in uh, until 2.30 because that's when this individual is going to be present. If you click on Modify and you go down, you can see that this is now John Doe, and you have a couple options. So once they have shown up and completed the study, you can choose to give them credit by hit, clicking on Participate and hit Update Signups. If they do not show up, but they email you. You could click on excuse no show. If you if they um, do not show up and they haven't let you know, you can click on unexcused no show. And no action taken is the default. Uh, you will have to click on one of these three. And this can be reversed. You can go back and click on modify later to reverse it. So let's say I give him an unexcused no show and I hit update signups. And now says, John Doe, no show, unexcused. Let's say I get an email from him 20 minutes later. It says, I'm so sorry, I missed the study. You can go back here, and you can either click on excuse, and you can click on excuse, no show. And you can hit update signups again. Uh, or, of course, you can give him credit for participating. Now, let's say someone shows up and they say, hey, um, I have to do these research requirements. I haven't done your study yet, but I, I, I couldn't sign up for your study. Uh, remember... Individuals can't sign up for your studies uh, by default three hours before the start of a study. You can change that in the settings, but by default, it's three hours beforehand. So let's say you're in the, um, uh, the Tuesday time slot at, at, uh, at 3 o'clock. You click on Modify. If you go down to Manual Sign Up, you can sign individuals up manually. You can do this by either typing in their user ID, so MJB70, or you can do this by signing them up uh, under their last name, if we do, um, we'll sign up John Doe again. And if we were to hit sign up here, we would be able to sign uh, Mr. Doe up again for a study. And then Mr. Doe would show up exactly as uh, he did before under view administer time slots. This is how you grant credit, manually grant credit, and cancel sessions using the SONA system.